In your MLA handbook, you'll notice that it tells you a certain format that is required for academic essays. You should have a header at the top of each page, a half inch from the top, set with your family name, a space, and then the page number, which should change for every page. At the top left of the first page, you should have your name, the professor's name, the course name, and the date before the title of your, of your document. There should be no extra spaces. You should not hit the Enter key to create any extra spaces between these. I'm going to show you how to make this happen in Google Docs. Here's how to make that happen in Google Docs. I've set this to have double spacing, so let's begin by typing the student's name, and I'm going to use the name Pato Lakeland, then the professor's name, then the class name, I'm going to use my shortcut here. You should add the section number, and then the date. After that, you can put the title and then begin writing the essay. Of course, with the title, that should be center aligned. And the first paragraph of the essay should have a first line indent, like that. Now, in my writing workshop class, I would ask you not to put my name in the top left header. The reason being that I know what my name is and I don't think there's going to be any confusion here. Usually the professor's name is there if you might hand in your essays in a general location that is used by many different professors. Uh, we don't do that at Lakeland College, at least not usually, so in my case at least it's not necessary for you to put my name. What I would like you to do is to write down the uh, name of the assignment. For example, Essay 1, Draft 1, for example. So in my class, write your name, the name of your class and section number, the, the assignment name, and then the date. Now, how do you do the header at the top right of the page? Now, let me write some nonsense text here. Some nonsense text. Uh, I'll just actually copy and paste to cheat some here. Create a quick paragraph, and then create some extra paragraphs, and there we go. All right, so now I'm going to create my header. The way to do that is to go to the Insert menu. In the Insert menu, you could go to the header, but really it's much easier just to go to Page Number, and then say Top of Page. You'll notice at the top right, it inserts a page number. This page number has gray shading, and that means that it's a field. That means that it's text, which is specially formatted. In this case, it will automatically change to a new page number on every page. What you want to do then is click to the left of the number, type your family name. I'm pretending that I am Tato Lakeland. And then don't forget to put an extra space between your family name and the page number. To return to the normal text, just click anywhere in the middle of the document, and now you're back. And that's all you need to do. That's how you can set up the first page information and the header at the top of your academic essay.